it's Green Swanica Protus. Happy Black History Month. And that's why I'm sharing important content by profound African American writers in honor and celebration of Black History Month. And I'd also like to give credit to what's in my background music. And this is by Audra Day, of course. This is Tigris and Tweed. And this is the instrumental version. So here we go. I'm now going to read my final selection. This is by one of my famous, one of my, I should say, favorite, famous African American poets, Etheridge Knight, who I studied for my master's degree in English, which means you know the study of writing and literature in graduate school long ago. And this is one of my favorite, I have to say my favorite poems by Etheridge Knight, and this is a very powerful, brief, succinct, concise yet incredibly powerful haiku by Etheridge Knight. And he overcame many, many societal obstacles. So um, here we go. I love this poem. It is so, again, brief yet powerful. And here we go. Haiku by Etheridge Knight. In the August grass, struck by the last rays of sun, a cracked teacup screams, oh, filled with such rich and important and profound symbolism. I love that haiku. Again, succinct, yet amazingly powerful. So anyhow, I hope you enjoyed my content offerings to celebrate and honor Black History Month. And I also, on a side note, I hope you enjoy my purple-hued hair. And I'm in purple today, and I've got everything in purple. My teen angels wanted me to go purple and then eventually plum for a while before I return to mermaid blue eventually. So, you know, I just wanted to share that with you. Okay, I will see you soonish with more and different content. And until next time, I'm Green Swanically Yours. His poetry blooms.